other boxes are no problem. There are a few typical suspension sores and use softers. The front suspension has wear on the rear silent blocks of levers, steering rods and struts. And in the back, shock absorbers and springs are the weak point. After all, the car is heavy. The silent blocks of the rear beam require attention. The metal sleeve eventually comes off the rubber cushion. The rear beam begins to live its own life. Prices for second-generation Zoffers in relatively working condition start at 360,000 rubles for 2005 cars. Broken and defective copies are sold even cheaper. I prefer to look for cars at an average price. In this case, it is about 500,000 rubles, when the notorious price-quality ratio is close to the optimum. Engine. Basically, the secondary market offers 140 horsepower gasoline Zafira with a 1.8 liter engine, which owners and mechanics consider the most hassle free. The second most popular car with the most modest, 1.6 liter gasoline engine. For a 7 seat compact van, its power is clearly not enough, only 105 forces. Buying a new car with such an engine is not the best investment. At the other extreme, there is a clearly redundant 200 horsepower racing aquarium of a branded bright blue color from the OPC Court Studio. Even used racing cars are still expensive for the mass buyer. Slightly behind in prevalence are diesel modifications with engines of 1.9 and 2.2 liters. The first develops 120 horsepower in the atmospheric version and 150 forces with supercharging. The second motor has 125 forces. These cars went to the country through official dealers. They did not have any particular disease. The main thing is not to refuel with diesel fuel at dubious gas stations. There is also a 125 horsepower version with a 1.7 liter turbo diesel. Such Zafira are brought exclusively from Europe, official dealers did not offer this motor. The more interesting it is to get acquainted with such a machine. The interior of even a 5-year-old car does not creak. There are no special complaints about ergonomics although the main architecture gives out 10-year-old solutions with the head. There are no special claims to the appearance. The Zafira's tendency to premature rust was eliminated during the 2008 restyling. This means that this car avoided this problem, as well as global repainting. The plastic headlights are not cloudy. The answer lies in the slightly visible traces of the former polishing of polycarbonate. Looks like the car was being followed. On long trips, the middle backrest turns into a comfortable armrest. Age is given out by numerous abrasions on the body, they are especially noticeable on black paint. No matter how polished, the car will still look a little shabby. Wheels 1 5 inch, alloy. And the tires are worn out almost to zero. You will have to buy new ones, and preferably hand cook. The spare tire is of this particular brand, and it is almost new. In the mandatory expenses section, we will enter 7,000 rubles for a set of tires and set aside another 2,000 rubles for tire fitting. If outwardly, Zafira still pulls on 113,000 kilometers, then the interior makes it doubtful. Here are the signs that the car has run more than stated in the price list, a sagging seat belt on the driver's side, a two-seized steering wheel, the driver's door has sagged and opens with a noticeable backlash. Navigation and trip computer can't speak Russian. Either learn German, or reprogram. We will set aside another 2,500 rubles for this matter. But these are seeds against the background of the forthcoming expenses for maintaining the turbo diesel in working condition. The exhaust system is equipped with a particulate filter, this is the first problematic place. When buying a diesel Zafira, it is advisable to have the car diagnosed by qualified mechanics, and here's why. Another hello from the past, frail rear view mirrors. It's good that they are heated. The particulate filter is an insidious notion of European bourgeois in pursuit of a low content of carcinogens and other harmful substances in exhaust gases. For its trouble-free life, experts advise regularly giving gas to clean the filter under load. If the car for the most part was in traffic jams and the filter was clogged to capacity, first kaput will come to him, and then to his pressure sensors. The engine will react sluggishly to gas, the consumption of diesel fuel will increase, and the car will behave like Winnie the Pooh who is stuck in the rabbit's hole after a plentiful feast. The price of a new filter is about 30,000 rubles. Expensive, but the filter can be eliminated. This procedure costs 15 to 20,000 rubles. An imitation of a particulate filter is inserted into the exhaust system. The old one is knocked out or cut out, the parameters of which are prescribed in the electronic brains of engine control. This has already been done on our car. 
in the pre-styling Zephyr of the second generation, 2005 to 2008, rust appeared primarily on the edge of the fifth door. Still have to update the rear crankshaft oil seal. He has already set out on his last journey, while sweating moderately, but still needs to be changed.